Hey guys, what's up? Uh, this is a little daunting because I'm not going to be cutting this or anything. Uh, I'm just going to let it play through, uh, make it more a just genuine conversation kind of between you and me. I know you can't talk back, but you know what I mean, um, of just kind of a look back on this past year, um, where I'm at, where my headspace is at with both the channel, just myself in general, and uh, where I want to go from here, because I think it's a good, good opportunity starting the year off. Happy New Year, by the way, 2021. Um, a good opportunity to kind of start it off on just a fresh note and see where we're going and yeah just kind of recap with you guys so um i just wanted to start off i thought it'd be interesting to look back where we were one year ago today and we were on episode 52 of our naruto shippuden reaction series it was called the power of the uchiha unless i just like titled the the video that and it was around like the end of the arc with naruto sai sakura and yamato going to find sasuke and like the reunion and all that um, it was around pretty much the end of that arc. And I also did uh, a little update video. I mean, I had around 9,400 subs around that time, which is a crazy difference until now. Um, it's insane how far we've come in such a short amount of time, which I'll get to later because I think that's that's more to top touch on than I am right now. But I thought it'd be interesting to see kind of where we were uh, a year ago because that's a very big difference. Now we've finished the entirety of Shippuden. We're watching Boruto, which is crazy. Um, it would have been nice if I had been to, like, episode 52 of Boruto, but we're getting there. Um, but yeah, I just think it was a really cool difference. So, I wanted to kind of recap what all happened this year, because like I said, it was a big year. Uh, I know not just for me, for a lot of people, I know, um, I mean, I am 100% blessed out of my mind to have so much support, especially this year, because I know so many more people aren't as fortunate to be able to work and do stuff like this especially with how their job like pertaining to their job and whatnot so i do recognize i am very blessed to be in the position i am and i wouldn't be here without you guys so just thank you first this is like the first thank you of many in the video um i'll get a little sappy but like i said i don't really want to cut it i wanted to make it more a genuine conversation um so i i like made like a couple bullet points i mean we finished shippuden um, I think the main thing I wanted to touch on was, I mean, I moved out in, uh, in 2020. I moved out of my parents' house. Um, I was going to college. I have an associate's degree in cybersecurity, which I don't really use. I did a little internship and whatnot. Um, not really much going on with that. And basically all I'm doing right now as kind of a checkpoint is YouTube, Twitch. That's what I'm doing. And you guys have given me the opportunity. I mean, I moved into my own place. Uh, I pay rent based off YouTube, Patreon, Twitch, and all that. And the fact that I can say that uh, and say that it's I'm confident in it, it blows my mind. Because a year ago today, I I, mean, I was like, the channel was growing and I was like, people were watching the reaction series, but I never expected it to get to this point. It's, it's absolutely insane what this channel has grown to. So just again, second thank you, thank you again. Um, so again, to kick off what, uh, what I wanted to touch on was the fact that I'm able to do this full time and give you guys content. I, I have goals in mind. I 100% have goals set in mind. I know I get a lot of comments like, Jack, uh, are you uh, reacting to this next? Jack, please watch this. Jack, react to this next. And I have a lot of plans, um, not just pertaining to reaction series, of course. I know you guys uh, want me to watch all your favorite shows and whatnot and be able to talk with you guys on it. And I will get to most things eventually. I mean, like people are like, Jack, you got to watch One Piece. I'm like, it is a commitment. So you know where I'm coming from. So um, it just in general, reactions aren't my end goal. Um, and I want to kind of break that down to saying, I know it's what this channel is built on. And I know it's what it's going to be kind of built on for a while. Like it's not, I'm not just going to be able to one day be like, hey guys, no more reactions. Uh, I'm actually just going to sit here and talk to you uh, every day in a, a mini vlog format and then like, get the same views or get the same amount of people caring, you know what I mean? So th they aren't my end goal. And this may come as a surprise to some people. Other people, they're like, probably just like, okay, Jack, I mean, I don't care. I'm just kind of here. I just watch whatever videos in my sub box every day. Um, because I think I have a lot more potential to show um, and not to like put down reaction videos or whatnot. I think I'm able to show, well, I started reaction videos, uh, especially on anime, in general in the first place to show my personality um i always wanted it to be more of a commentary and not a you watching the show and then i'm just there i'm just kind of i'm just kind of there 
Um, I always wanted to be more of a commentary and you guys see my personality because I mean, as many of you know, I have a channel, uh, Jack the Bus in accordance with iShinobi that I now upload on a lot, um, that I was doing for four years and I got a little bit of growth here and there. Some videos popped, some didn't, but never the amount of growth I saw in iShinobi. Um, and I took the iShinobi idea and I ran with it and I saw the opportunity to show people who I am. Um, and not to like toot my own horn. I don't want you guys, I don't want to make it seem like I'm like, I'm awesome. Why don't more people watch me? No, I wanted to be able to show off who I am more and my creative style and whatnot with video editing. So I think that's a good kind of pivot point into showing. I, I think I have a lot more to show than what I have been doing or what I've done in the past. And I think that's why I'm really glad I started uploading on Jack the Bus again. Um, which is, like I said, is my non-reaction channel. Basically, anything that isn't a reaction video, I put on there. And it's more heavily edited. And I, I said, I don't even edit every single video on there because I need help. Because I post six days a week on iShinobi. And I want to post on there as well. So not every video edited there. I mean, I've had a, a couple people go through. And uh, I probably had like five to six videos in total on that channel edited for me but like i said it helps a lot to have someone help me with that because i get very overwhelmed at times um but still even whenever i'm not editing them it gives me the opportunity to be more creatively fulfilled if that makes sense i love doing reaction videos and i love watching these shows and being able to talk with you guys that's that's why i started doing reaction videos was because i wanted to watch through shippuden and talk with other people that are just as passionate about the show um, because I watched OG Naruto and I fell in love, man. I, I, I haven't loved a show like that in a while. And I saw people doing reaction series and I was like, Hey, I should do that. I, I want to do that. That looks cool to be able to watch an episode. And then like other people see other people kind of like relive their childhood also in a sense, because a lot of people grew up with Naruto and Naruto Shippuden. So a lot of people got that opportunity to kind of live vicariously through me again, I think, and, and then reliving the hype through certain moments and the despair in certain moments. And I just thought that was so cool, man, seeing reactions to just my videos and whatnot. And I just think I I started it with that perspective in mind. And it's I still have that perspective in mind. I have so much hope for Boruto. I'm loving the series so far. I know it's not the most popular show in the world. I know it gets dunked on a lot and i think it has its flaws like any show but man the potential i see in that show is is immaculate i'm so excited for the future of that um in the future it could bring to just like the naruto universe in general but that's another story um i'm kind of rambling either way um reactions are my end goal uh eventually i want to get to a point where sure we'll do a reaction series and i'll post like three or four videos a week on it but like my main then on the side my main focus is twitch streams every single day twitch highlights on jack the bus every single day you know skits on jack the bus you know what i mean like stuff like that anime conversations on iShinobi, uh anime uh, reviews on iShinobi, not just reactions reviews other kind of skits on iShinobi, content that doesn't like it catches you more off guard when it hits your sub box, if that makes sense. And I know reliability is nice. That's why I said I'm never going to get to the point where I'm like, hey, guys, I'm just not doing reaction series anymore. Bye. I'm just like, I'm just off the face of the earth because I still love doing it. But I want to have this branch branch into more things because, like I said, it's such creative fulfillment that improves my mental health. Like I said, I think uploading on Jack the Bus again this year has improved my mental health in in ways you can't even imagine uh being able to express myself in ways aside from just just the you know the usual reaction videos is done wonders so i really appreciate all the support that you guys have shown on that channel i mean i posted my first attack on titan game playthrough episode and it hit 300,000 views which i it's it's i don't know how to even explain that feeling because i hadn't had a video hit that kind of views that's just me and my personality uh and my gameplay in a long 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 time um and just to catch that wave and you guys being there to boost it into that wave and being there to support me and hold me up thank you i can't thank you enough it's it's an amazing feeling um so 
I just wanted to kind of lay it out there. I don't want this video to be too long. I know I'm about to hit 10 minutes. Uh, I feel like I kind of rambled for a little bit of it, but I just wanted to kind of, I talk about this in a lot of my live streams a lot at, on Twitch. I just kind of dump my brain and some of it probably makes sense. Some of it probably doesn't, but I wasn't even planning on, on doing this video originally. And then I was like, man, I should check in. I should, I, I used to make update videos. I should check in and talk to them and really be honest with them and talk to them. Um, super excited for attack on titan season four gonna be dropping episodes every time those release um full metal we're finishing up on patreon right now um which i'm gonna be bringing over to youtube very soon uh, we're not finishing it up on patreon but we'll probably be have like a, a month or so left on patreon for full metal very excited to finish that very excited to bring it over to youtube for you guys to see uh, my reaction to all of that because like i said it's an amazing show um and then not sure where we're going from there because i'm gonna do a poll on patreon uh like i usually do for the next show we watch I'm guessing either Death Note or Hunter x Hunter will win uh, because those seem the two most requested. Um, I'm going to put One Piece on hold for now. I'm, I've never seen it, um, but if I ever commit to reacting to One Piece, I want it to be the one thing I do because that is a big commitment. That is a lot of episodes. So, um, yeah, I mean, my goals for this year, uh, 150K on I Shinobi. We're getting close to 100K. We're getting close to 90K. Uh, if we're on track correctly, we'll hit 100K in February, which again blows my mind um goals again this year 150k on i shinobi 100k on jack the bus the 100k on jack the bus is a lot more out there of a goal it's a lot less likely to happen um i'll have to have a lot more videos pop off and whatnot um i'll have to upload a lot more uh put a lot more effort in but i think we can do it i think by the end of the year we can have two channels with over 100,000 subscribers um i think it's doable and with that, I also want to hit six uploads a week, no matter what, on iShinobi, two uploads a week, no matter what, on Jack the Bus, and three streams a week minimum. Monday, Wednesday, Friday, typically. I think that's a good balance. Anyways, that's pretty much it for this. I just wanted to check in with you guys. Um, I'll try to respond to some comments on here. I usually don't read comments too often on reaction videos because people like to be spoilery and whatnot. People aren't even, like, drop spoilers. So, like, hey, Jack, remember when you said you were worried about th that person dying i'm not gonna say anything but you should be you know what i mean so i love you guys so so much but uh, you guys are you guys are memes sometimes uh, i usually read like the top comments on the right reaction videos and usually the notification squad gets some hearts and whatnot too so um i'll try to respond some comments on here some if you want to ask questions in the comments drop them below um i'll try and answer them as best as possible i don't always have all the answers but uh i love you guys a lot i really do i'm from the bottom of my heart i can't say thank you enough times for this opportunity you've given me to work as a content creator full time yeah, I can't put it into words. If I told Jack a year ago, two years ago, that I was doing this full time, he would he would just laugh in my face. The fact that this is possible. Um, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I love you guys. Uh, here's to another year and uh, dear 2021. We're ready for you. Peace, peace, guys.